So, in this fight with Conor McGregor, the con artist, Conor McGregor, as you can see over here in the first round, Conor was, you know, pretty aggressive, throwing, bringing it to Dustin Poirier. He was bringing it to Dustin. He was being aggressive. Throwing light kick, leg kicks, throwing low kicks, throwing left hands, throwing right hands, throwing jabs, lightning fast, right? But then Dustin checks that leg kick. Connor doesn't like that check leg kick. He gets stumbled. Doesn't really get stumbled, but that leg kick hurts. He hides the hurt. Then Dustin pressures him a lot more. You can see right there, he, he pressures him. Yes, the pressure. That's what led to the guillotine here, you see. So yes, Poirier comes forward. He lands a left hook or something. Comes to the corner, attempts a double leg. Then Connor goes for a fucking guillotine. Even though he said in, during the press conference that during the build-up to the fight, Conor was saying that he doesn't give a fuck about taps and all that other bullshit and decisions. He only cares about knockouts. He's trying to come in there and take, take a man's head off, but you're trying to submit Dustin. So it kind of shows that there's a lot of lies and disingenuous bullshit going on in Conor's mind. Like, Conor is not, Conor is not an honest fighter. He's a bullshit fighter. Is he a good fighter? No, he's not even a... Okay, measure good, dude. Measure it. He won the title. Okay, cool. He's a good fighter. But he's not He's not elite. Not lightweight. He, he's a top 15 lightweight. Not a top 5 lightweight. Not a top 10 lightweight. Not even a top 10 lightweight. No, he's not. He's not. But anyways, look at this guillotine right here. It's not even properly locked in. Uh, Dustin, he does very well. Defend it. See, he's in full guard, but then Dustin is jumping to half. Yeah, he's in full guard right now. Uh, Dustin seems he's fine. He got out. See, then he starts raining down elbows on Connor's face, slashing his face open. Raining elbows down. Yeah, you see Connor is throwing elbows from the bottom, but those are not really that effective. Trying to pass his guard there. Dustin's trying to pass his guard. Stacking to the left. Then he slices him open with an elbow here. Dustin slices McGregor open with an elbow. And McGregor's getting raped here. He's getting... Okay, I slashed that from the record. He's getting beat really badly here in this round. Not even close. Not even close. I don't think there's anyone that can tell me that he won the first round. Connor didn't win the first round. He got rocked and badly hurt and almost finished. He did get finished. No, not almost. He got finished. <laughs> I take that back too. He got finished, bro. He's just getting grounded and pounded here. Getting the shit beat out of him. Then he goes for another half-assed guillotine that isn't even locked in. Dustin easily escapes. And then here, the ankle rolls out, and he just falls to the ground like a little bitch. Man, Connor is just so disappointing, bro. And then he's sitting over here with a cast on, literally with a cast on, crying to the ref, crying to the doctor, but he's still talking shit. He's still saying that, his wife, that Dustin's wife was messaging him in the DMs and trying to do something with him being very disrespectful having death threats before the fight saying he's gonna kill dustin and all this crazy stuff but it's just a fight bro it's not that serious like there's a ref to protect you but um yeah i mean Con connor's not a top elite lightweight anymore he's just he's just a ufc fighter that's all not even a contender i don't think he deserves to even be in a title title picture? No, he doesn't. Last win was at lightweight at, by Eddie Alvarez. The last win at welterweight was... Maybe he should fight at welterweight. 
maybe he should move up to welterweight because this weight class, lightweight, not working out for him. Who can he beat at lightweight in top 10? He's not beating RDA. That's a ground fighter. That's it. That's a Brazilian black belt. He's not beating RDA. He's not beating Benil Dariush. I think that the best fight for him now is Tony. That's the fight to make because they're both losing. They're both on the losing skit. They're both on a losing streak. So I think the fight to make is Tony Ferguson. And if Connor gets back with a couple with one win or something like that, he should fight Justin Gaethje. If he beats Justin Gaethje. But this is all stuff that I'm speculating. He's never going to be a guy like Justin Gaethje. A guy of a caliber of a Justin Gaethje. That's not going to happen. How is he going to be Gaethje? Gaethje's throwing leg kicks. That's Connor's kryptonite now. Leg kicks. Leg kicks and Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu. That's, that's Connor's kryptonite. Not just leg kicks. He can, his boxing is overrated too. It's not that good. His stand-up isn't even great. It's all right, but it's not that good. I mean, the only people he's beat is featherweights. That's it. He beat Nate Diaz. And not not really. He lost the second fight with Nate Diaz. He got he got beat in that fight, in my opinion. But in a lot of people's opinion, actually, he lost that fight. First fight, he got strangled and submitted with Nate. You know, the referee had to save his life. And yeah, I mean, Con- Connor was a. One of the biggest hype jobs in the 21st century of, of in the in the in the history of combat sports. Dana White was always being favor, being favoritism. Dana White's favoritism is what saved him here. Imagine if Dana White didn't like Connor. He would be giving him the toughest matchups, and he wouldn't be feeding him cowboy. That was on a fucking losing streak. Big losing streak, not just a small one, a big one. But yeah, man, Connor is a joke, bro. He's talking shit from a position of weakness. You don't do that. You talk shit from a position of strength. You fucking idiot. But yeah, man, uh, this is my post fight review to the Connor McGregor and Dustin Poirier fight. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Tell me what you guys think. I'm out, peace.